And welcome to our very first day of school. I am so excited that you all have made it through the summer safely and you're here with us for our very first day on August 17th. Here at Oakview Elementary School, our vision is to promote a high-performing culture and climate that inspires all community of learners to achieve academic excellence. Our mission is to reach, teach, and equip. Our theme for the year is maximizing our potential. So we appreciate you for trusting us with your students. Students, it's so great to see you this morning. I'm looking for great things from you. And now for our creed. My name is Robert Danzo and I'm in Ms. Rare's homeroom. I am an Oakville Elementary School student. I have great expectations for myself. I accept the challenge to become the best student that I can be. I am proud of my school. The vision of Oakview is to promote a high-performing culture and climate to inspire our community of learners to achieve academic excellence. I accept the responsibility for my behavior and its results. I am determined to be safe, responsible, productive, and respectful. I have high expectations for myself, and I'll reach my full potential. I choose to be great. Parents, I am proud to announce that our food nutrition department, in conjunction with our transportation department, have worked together to collaborate, and we will continue to offer food, uh, grab-and-go meals on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays for all DeKalb County students. For those students that are currently registered at Oakview or anyone in the Cedar Grove area, please feel free to come by the school between the hours of 11 and 1 o'clock, again on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday to pick up a grab-and-go lunch. There will be a school bus parked right outside the front of the building and they will have grab-and-go lunches. Students will be required to enter their lunch numbers to receive those, but you will be able to get that on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Students will receive two meals on Monday, two meals on Wednesday, a meal and a snack for the weekend on Friday. Additional announcements, please remember that attendance in virtual learning is mandatory in DeKalb County School District, and we are uh, mandated to follow all attendance protocols. And so please make sure that your students are logging on and your students are participating in lessons and turning in assignments as, uh, as prescribed by their teachers so that they can get um, noted for their daily attendance. I want to say Thank you so very much. At this moment, we have about 515 Chromebooks and iPads that have been deployed out to our students. We're missing about 150 of you, and we can't wait to see you today between the hours of 9 and 12 o'clock at the school. So if you will meet us there to get your students' Chromebook, and if they're pre-K, we will give them an iPad. Please make sure that you come. But for those of you that have already come and you've already messaged us to make sure that your child has what they need, I want to tell you thank you so much. We greatly appreciate your commitment and we greatly appreciate you for coming early and making sure you have what you need. For those of you that will be joining us on Monday, we can't wait to see you. And for those of you that have reached out to me due to extenuating circumstances, we will meet you on the day that we have uh, agreed upon to get your Chromebook. Um, another announcement that we have, please make sure um, you all will be provided a virtual, you were provided a virtual learning checklist when you came to pick up your devices. Please make sure that today after our um, YouTube pep rally or back to school opening, if you would just use your checklist for your day, that will be your activities. In addition to the four activities that you will see at the end of today's uh, YouTube presentation, um, but use that virtual learning checklist to make sure that you're going by everything that you 
CC for the before uh, virtual learning. That's where you should be. Parents, please be reminded but that between uh, yesterday, today, and no later than Tuesday, you should hear from your teacher with all of your logging information from any platform that they will be using for their classroom instruction. So please make sure that you're checking your emails and you're checking your class dojo so that you can uh, get that information from your teacher. It should be coming in your dojo private messages. If you do not have dojo, please make sure that you sign up for dojo. That is the way to stay connected to our school, connected to your class and connected to your teacher. Um, I put many, many messages on dojo. It's the quickest and easiest way to disseminate information. So please make sure that you are signed into your child's dojo class and you are checking the class story and you're checking the school story on a daily basis. Last but not least, all teachers um, will begin instruction on tomorrow, Tuesday, August 18th. So um, at the end of this, you'll be given information on how you can access those classrooms. So please make sure that you're paying close attention to Dr. Davis so that she can show you how to get to your teachers on Tuesday. And with that being said, I'll now turn this over to Dr. Davis for her tech tip of the day. Hello, Oakview students and parents. This is Dr. Davis, and this is the most important video you're going to have to watch to start off your school year. This video is going to show you how to get to this wonderful website, Clever. Clever is where you and your child are going to go to every morning on their Chromebooks once they sign in to start their instructional day. So once you sign into Clever, that is where you'll find all the learning platforms that your child will be accessing for the course of this year. So let's go ahead and start. Once you sign into your Chromebook, open up the Chrome browser, or you're going to open up an Edge browser. Come to your search browser bar, and you're going to type in the following address, clever.com forward slash I-N-N forward slash decab forward slash and then you're going to hit enter pause the video right here so you can view this web address and make sure once you hit enter you save this because this is going to be your favorite place to come to so go ahead and find that star in your top right hand corner and add this to your favorites page I'm going to add it to my favorites bar so it will always be at the very top of my search bar when I open up a new tab. Now you're going to come right here and click login with Active Directory. Make sure you are in the DeKalb County School District. That is why you type in DeKalb after I in in the forward slash. Click right here. And now it's going to ask you to log in with your student number. That's my teacher number, so I'm going to go ahead and type in my sample student number that I have. So pause the video and type in your full student number with the S, and then at the CAB schools, GA, a period, O-R-G. Then you're going to type in the password, DCAB. But at the very end, you're going to make sure you type in your grade that you're in. So every student is going to start off with DCAB as their password. And then the last two numbers are going to be the grade that you're in. So if you're in first grade, you're going to type 01. If you're in second grade, you're going to type 02 as your full password, DCAB 02. If you're in third grade, what do you think that password is going to be? DCAB03. If you're in fourth grade, what do you think that password is going to be? DCAB04. And if you're in fifth grade, what do you think that password is going to be? Ding, ding, ding. DCAB05. So I am going to type in the password for this student and then we're going to log in. All right, now you are logged in. So this student, this student will know that they are in this teacher's classroom. And look, they have a new teacher announcement. So they can go ahead and click right there to read their new teacher's announcement. At the very top, you can see your school 
Oak View Elementary. And then if you have a message, you can come right up here to messages and click and see who sent you a message. Now, let's go ahead and scroll down and see some important resources. You definitely have to go and see Verge. That's one of your favorites. Imagine Learning, Imagine Math Facts, and Imagine Math. And then you will see all of your homeroom teachers' pages that they invited you to. Make sure you click in your teacher's homeroom to see what you have for your assignments for that day. Thanks for watching. Hey, OVU family. This is Ms. Taylor Donovan checking in. I pray everyone is well and staying safe during these uncharted times. I know last school year we had weekly affirmations, but this year we will have inspirational vitamins, or IVs for short. When I think of IVs, I think of a quick way for the body to receive the nutrients it needs to properly function. So with our inspirational vitamins, we're going to receive food for the soul. With that being said, this virtual learning experience is new for everyone. And at times, it will be challenging. But as a community, we will grow through this together. Reach out to your child's teacher or any support staff at The View. Remember, you are not alone. Together, we are all you strong. I love you. Be blessed. What's up, boys and girls? Mr. Danzo, a.k.a. DJ Super Crunk on your morning announcements team. All right, now it's time for your call to action. The four things you need to do to have a successful first day of school. All right, here we go. Step number one, I need you to get your parents to send a picture of yourself to your teacher on Class Dojo. Hopefully your parents are already connected to your teacher on Class Dojo. If not, parents, parents, just be calm and be patient. Your teachers will send you an invite. When you get that invite to Class Dojo, please message your teacher with a picture of your student with their name. That is how we're going to take attendance. So yes, so step number one, we've gotta take attendance. Step two, on this YouTube page, on this YouTube video that you're watching me on now in the discussion. Here's the question. How do you feel about virtual learning? I just need you to write a sentence, two sentences, three sentences. Would you rather be back in the building? Are you tired of virtual learning from the spring? Do you miss your friends? Or are you excited that you don't have to be around all those kids and you just get to be in the comfort of your own home with the virtual learning? Step number three, to have an awesome first day of school. We're gonna have a flip grid right now. On the count of three, I'm gonna post a flip grid. I'm gonna post a flip grid code on the screen. Here we go, one, two, three. <sighs> you like that magic? Right now, you are looking at the flip grid code. Here's what I need you to do. I need you to upload a video of your first day of school. Get your parents to help you. All you need to do is go to this flip grid code and it's going to prompt you to upload a video. You can pre-record a video or use Flipgrid, the app itself, to record a video of your first day of school. And guess what? We might use a bit of that video for our opening for the next Wake Up Oakview morning announcements. I know you can't wait. Now, last but not least, this is my favorite part. My friend, my one of my best friends, DJ Bussy Breeze or Miss Bussy Breeze, you know her as Miss Bussy, is a third grade teacher, one of the best third grade teachers in the land. She has created a Kahoot. And we're gonna do that Kahoot at 9 a.m. So once 9 a.m. hits, I need you to go to Kahoot.it. And at the end of this video, I'm gonna post the pin number for you to access that Kahoot. Now, guess what? I'm going to tell you a secret, but don't tell anyone. The top three places are going to get a very special surprise. Yes, you heard me right. The top three places, the top three winners for this Kahoot game will get a very special surprise. But in order to get your surprise, when it's time for you to put in your nickname, you need to put in your first and last name. That way we can find you. Woo! That's a lot of information. Once again, step one, 
attendance, send a picture to your homeroom teacher via class dojo. Step two, type in the comments, how do you feel about virtual learning? Step number three, I need you to go to the Flipgrid and post a video of your first day of school. And step number four, Four, I need you to go to Kahoot.it and you're going to see the pin number at the end of this video at 9 a.m. Not 9.05, not 9.10, 9 a.m. Soon after this video, go to Kahoot.it and you might have the chance to win those very special prizes. You're the smartest kids in the world at the best school in the world. And with that being said, have a great day, Oakview.